And we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to create a music icon. Let us create an ellipse first and we want to rotate that. So use the cursor tool, click on it again. Then you will be able to rotate it. Now we use the busy tool. I've got the snapping enabled and we need the snap to paths active. Hold control when you go upwards, left click again, hold control to the left. Hold control to the bottom, close your shape, hold shift and get rid of the stroke by clicking on the X and then use the same color swatch. I'll transform that a little bit, I'll make it thinner and smaller. Now select both and go to path and union, it's one object now. Final step is the hardest in this case, just left click and left click and drag. We want to create multiple lines and afterwards I'll show you how to join them. Snap to pass is still active, it helps but it also creates a little bit of a problem here with the handle so turn it off temporarily. And turn it on again and close your shape. Afterwards, select it, use the notes tool, and zoom a little bit in. I'll hold control and use the mouse wheel for that. Hover over your line and you will see this hand icon, and then you can adjust the curvature just like this. Let me reposition the notes slightly. Let me shift click on both elements, I drag them to the right hand side. And if I give it a fill, you can see we've got a little bit of a problem here. So we want to join them first. You need to select it, go to path and combine. Afterwards, select the notes tool, select it all and click on this icon, join selected notes. Now it's one object created from these two lines and we can give it a fill. Afterwards, shift click on the other, the big object and union it again. Create a circle with the ellipse tool, hold shift and control when you drag it, I'll put it to the bottom and give it a different fill. Select it all, object, align and distribute and align both of them to the center. When we size anything here, just hold control and shift. Make sure you can see your rulers, press control R if you can't and drag them just like this. They should snap to your icon and then use the busy tool. Follow your guides. It helps to turn off the snapping temporarily. Give it a fill, no stroke. Put it in between the music icon and the circle. Then shift click on the circle of end division and now it's all about finding a good color combination let me use something bluish and it should be fine let's go to edit delete the guides select it all ctrl g to group it and now you can export it and this i can create this music icon in inkscape i hope this video was helpful thanks for watching and i'll see you next time